The September 11th attacks were a series of four coordinated terrorist attacks by the Islamic terrorist group Al-Qaeda on the United States on the morning of Tuesday, September 11th, 2001. The attack killed 2,996 people, injured, injuring over 6,000 others, and caused at least $10 billion in property and infrastructure damage and $3 trillion in total costs. Four passenger airlines operated by two major U.S. passenger air carriers, United Airlines and American Airlines, all of which departed from airports on the northeastern United States bound for California, were hijacked by 19 Al-Qaeda terrorists. Two of the planes, American Airlines Flight 11 and United Airlines Flight 175, were crashed into the North and South Towers, respectively of the World Trade Center complex in New York City. Within an hour and 42 minutes, both 110-story towers collapsed with debris and the resulting fires causing uh, partial or com complete collapse of all other buildings in the World Trade Center complex, including the 47-story uh, 7 World Trade Center tower, as well as significant damage to 10 other large surrounding structures. A third plane, American Airlines Flight 77, was crashed into the Pentagon in Arlington County, Virginia, leading to the particular collapse of the building's western side. The fourth plane, United States Airlines Flight 93, initially was steered towards Washington, D.C., but crashed into a field in Stony Creek Township near Shakesville, Pennsylvania, after a passenger tried to overcome the hijackers. It was the deadliest incident for firefighters and law enforcement officers in the history of the United States, with 343 and 72 killed, respectively. Suspicion for the attack quickly fell on Al-Qaeda. The United States responded to the attacks by wa launching the war on terror and invading Afghanistan to dispose of the Taliban, which had harbored Al-Qaeda. Many countries strengthened their anti-terrorism legislation and expanded the powers of law enforcement and intelligence agencies to prevent terrorist attacks. Although Al-Qaeda's leader, Osama bin Laden, initially denied any involvement, in 2004 he claimed responsibility for the attacks. Al-Qaeda and bin Laden cited U.S. support of Israel, the presence of U.S. troops in Saudi Arabia, and sanctions against Iraq as motives. Having evaded capture for almost a decade, bin Laden was located and killed by SEAL Team 6 of the U.S. military in May 2011. The destruction of the World Trade Center and nearby infrastructure caused serious damage to the economy of lower Manhattan and had a significant effect on global markets closing Wall Street until September 17th and the civilian airspace in the U.S. and Canada until September 13th. Many closings, evacuations, and cancellations followed out of respect of fear for other attacks. Cleanup of the World Trade Center site was completed in May 2002 and the Pentagon was repaired within a year. On November 18th, 2006, construction of the One World Trade Center began at the World Trade Center site. The building was officially opened on November 3, 2014. Numerous memorials have been constructed, including the National September 11th Memorial and Museum in New York City, the Pentagon Mo Memorial in Arlington County, Virginia, and the Flight 93 National Memorial in a field in Stony Creek Township near Shankville, Pennsylvania. In New York City, more than 90% of the workers and visitors who died in the towers had been at or above the points of impact. In the North Tower, 1,355 people at or above the point of impact were trapped and died of smoke inhalation, fell or jumped from the tower to escape the smoke and flames, or were killed in the building's eventual collapse. The destruction of all three staircases in the tower when Flight 11 hit made it impossible for anyone above the impact zone to escape. 107 people below the point of impact died as well.